In this video, we're going to walk through calibrating the brew valves on your Fetco batch brewer to ensure that you get the proper water volume for your batch brew coffee. We recommend checking the calibration and recalibrating if necessary at least once a quarter. The tools you're going to need for this process are a grain scale that measures up to two kilograms, a one gallon container or pitcher, and a rag to clean up spills and scale dry. First, we're going to weigh out the water from a half gallon batch. A half gallon of water is equivalent to 1.89 liters or 1,892 grams. If we don't get that amount of water, then we may need to change the brew valve calibration setting. If the brewer is then idling, then brew two batches and take the measurement of the second batch for a more accurate reading. Uh, while you're brewing, don't pour water on the top of the tap. Now we're going to turn the brewer on, hold our finger at the bottom of the screen to enter into the programming menu. Now we'll scroll left twice to outputs, scroll down to enter into that menu, scroll right until you see right or left valve. This is a single-sided brewer, so you only see right valve, but if you have a double-sided brewer, you'll see right valve and left valve. Scroll down to enter into that menu, scroll right to right valve calibrate, and scroll down to see the calibration number. This is the brew valve calibration number. To increase your total brew volume, you're gonna decrease this number. And to decrease your total brew volume, you're gonna increase this number. The volume of water dispensed from your brewer will vary from batch to batch, but we recommend trying to keep the half gallon within 30 grams above or below a true half gallon. By routinely calibrating your vector brew valves, these variances will be kept to a minimum.